Hey everyone, Chris here with another This Week in Hating Dice video. Uh, it's been a pretty busy week, obviously, with um, Star Wars Legion launch going on. I ran all of the events for that, which did involve me doing all the painting for Star Wars Legion as well, which uh, was fun. I live-streamed most of it, and uh, it went really well, but that was the Saturday... Well, I did the painting last week. Saturday was the actual games, and that's when I got to play my first batch of games. And yeah, I really enjoyed it actually. I don't regret buying into it at all. Uh, maybe my choice of faction, seeing as I uh, I couldn't really lose with the uh, with the Imperials, it felt really strong. Um, the speeder bikes are just awesome. But I've chosen Rebels, so we're going to stick with it. So I've got my snow speeder to build and uh, a few other bits and pieces. So we'll see how that goes. Um, then Sunday, a painting demo. Still working on. Um, He's got a Space Hulk, uh, Space Hulk Terminators for Greg. I wanted them to look good, so I didn't rush them at all. But they will touch wood. The Space Hulk set will be finished on Sunday, and uh, I'll be able to move on to painting other things. Then Monday was Warhammer Fancy Roleplay again. We ran uh, another fun session on the journey to Altdorf. Uh, lots of different uh, bits going on. I introduced a... Uh, kind of a side scenario just to give them some extra stuff to do some more combat we fought off some goblins some squigs and some giant spiders uh, not necessarily in that order uh, but that was good fun i really enjoyed it i made up some different rules to the goblin fanatic and then uh in the book because i just wanted it to be more a bit more random and fun and that worked really well uh, the players seemed to enjoy it no one questioned the uh the rulings and stuff like that which was pretty good i just I enjoyed it, I think the players enjoyed it, so we'll see. Uh, next week should pick up the actual main plot lines again. Then Tuesday, um, it was a long day, I went in to uh, work early and tried to finish off reorganising the sentry boxes, um, miniatures area, so it's mainly done now. I'm going to go through and um, price a few bits and pieces differently and there be, should be some good deals to be had. Then uh, Wednesday was a quiet, quiet day. I tried to just relax and not really do anything. Still trying to gear down, but you know it is. There's always something going on. Been doing lots of um, prep work for being able to do more mobile stuff. Uh, more uh, so, lots of bits and pieces have been arriving this week. So got like piles of stuff to be working on and making sure it all works together and getting the setup right. Um, so it was an expensive time, but hopefully it'll be worth it if I can get this press pass for Worlds and um, get some really good content from out there. I'm hoping to step up the quality of the mobile and uh, on-site stuff. We'll see. Uh, Thursday was another shift in work, but then I did stay afterwards and play a game of Rune Wars. Took the elves out again, but I tried to do something a bit different. I used uh, Megan instead, and um, I did a combat monster with her. Where every face on the dice it does something. And not, I still managed to whiff some rolls, even when blanks become mortal wounds. I still managed to whiff rolls with rolling like double accuracy on the blue dice. Sickened me. <laughs> but that was pretty good fun. And then we played, me and Joe played a game of Dice Throne, um, which was really good fun. I think we streamed it on the Sentry Boxes channel. It should be on their, uh, their YouTube channel by now. Yeah, when I played with Greg and stuff. But that was pretty good fun. I really enjoyed the game, actually. Really simple. So, yeah, I've been planning on trying to edit some videos today, get more stuff out, but that's all Sentry Box stuff. And then hopefully touch wood coming into next week everything should calm down i'm going to have the table cleared to be able to do some nice pre-recorded stuff and i'll ha try and get a balance between these kind of more personal just vlogging style videos uh, and then more stuff in the studio area as well so we'll see how it goes if i can actually uh follow through and get it all done but i don't know i've got best of intentions and yeah, I need to try and get a way to um, like monetize the channel a little bit better, I think. And maybe not even just monetize it, just become more streamlined and 
what I'm trying to do because I feel like I'm a bit all over the place at the minute and it's hard work trying to keep uh, all the different irons in fires and plates spinning is how I feel at the moment so I probably need to just bring it back down maybe try and get one or two games to focus on even if I just rotate and uh, do it that way but I'm trying to cover a lot of stuff at the moment so let me know what you guys think what you guys want to see have some comments on the videos for what kind of stuff you want more of I know that it te seems to be just these blog updates weekly and um, what I plan on doing once some mobile setups finished and I've got actual stuff I can just record quick videos is I will have a series of like actual just vlogging stuff as well because uh, I can just do that on the mobile and just upload it straight away but I might start a second channel for stuff like that just so that people who want to have that kind of content I don't know I'm, I'm still undecided how I'm going to do it but we'll see everything seems to be going well considering um, Evie had her jabs yesterday so she's been not too well today don't think you can hear her crying she was uh, was earlier but um, just all those fun new parenty things you go through and yeah that's about it nothing too exciting sorry um, this week we have Shades Fire coming up tomorrow so I'll be running that Maybe playing, depending if it's odd numbers I'll play. I've dug out the, uh, my corn wall band, which is uh, happily stored in a plastic bag at the moment, so I need to sort them properly. But uh, yeah, so I've got the, um, the corn wall band I'll take with me to play if it's odd numbers. And then Saturday, uh, Sunday I should be finishing Greg's Space Hulk. Monday coming up will be more Woofer Up, and then I'm pretty open. I might actually play another game of Rune Wars on Monday. Try no, um, everything feels like it's going pretty well. I just want to kick on and actually get get a bit of drive back. I'm enjoying doing doing this kind of video a little bit more. So maybe I'll do this. I'm, a lot of the post-production work is starting to grind at me at the moment. It's kind of piling up and I need to get through it. But recording more content that needs producing is um, kind of difficult. So we'll see. I think I might split off a, uh, a video gaming channel though where I can do more of that stuff because I don't know how much crossover there is so make sure you guys let me know and uh, we'll go from there. Thanks a lot guys. Uh, if you like the video please give us a thumbs up, make sure you subscribe that's set to dip again and um, I do have some giveaways coming up next week. That pile at the back there should all be stuff to get given away. Uh, I did get a copy of Blood Bowl from uh, the store to give away as well. So it was from a sentry box. So there should be uh, there should be some good prizes coming up. But we'll we'll do that probably. Uh, where, where are we? I believe we're at like fifteen hundred. So if we if we can get to sixteen hundred subscribers. I'll give away the copy of Blood Bowl at random. Um, yeah, so that's what we're going to do. Uh, it's decided now. We're going to push on. If we can get to 1,500, uh, 1,600 subscribers, it's another 80 people, I want to say. If we get 80 more subscribers, we'll start the next batch of giveaways. In the meantime, thanks for watching, everyone, and I'll see you on the next one.